Good evening and thank you for joining us. My name is Rodney Batiste. I'm a master instructor and director of WCRB Karate. This is first degree black belt, Andrea Arazi. And today, we're gonna to be looking at the green belt pattern, Hangul. First, we'll be doing it slow, then we'll slow it down a little more and demonstrate the angles. Are you ready? Begin. Okay, so now let's take a look at what she did. Now, consistent with these patterns, what the patterns do is they build your coordination and your ambidexterity, ambidexterity, allowing you to be able to use these safety moves on both sides. So, with the first move, the block and the punch, you're gonna see a difference in the way that she turns behind her. So she's no longer been gonna be using the 180 degree turn because that would get her in an improper position. Watch closely. She turns and blocks. She stays still, she punches. She prepares, she does a double shift and blocks. Then she punches. Prepares with the knife hand, shifts the lead leg over to put her into a back stance. She then blocks with the lead hand and thrusts over ah. the hand. Now, if doing this right, the non-blocking hand should be directly beneath the elbow. There should be a right angle here. And she's in a front stance, shoulders wall to wall. She'll step up, placing the lead hand in the small of her back. The non uh, uh, Striking uh, hand is going to be on her shoulder. She then pivots, comes all the way around ah. back to the front of her and executes the first of two back fists. She preps, moves forward for a second back fist. Ah. Now she'll be repeating the same moves that she did to begin the pattern. She spins on her lead foot, does a forearm block with her left hand, stays in place, and then punches. Now watch closely, there's a double shift with her feet. She moves her left leg, right leg, and then shifts into a forearm block with her right hand. She then does a left punch. She prepares herself, she doesn't move, she simply shifts to a corner of the room to execute the first of a kick aim, stepping down, double punch. Now she knows she does the technique right because she has an opposite foot and hand technique. She has to go to the other corner of the room. She X turns to the corner of the room. So effectively, she's made a V. She then kicks, aims, steps down. She knows she does this right because she has an opposite foot and hand. Now she blocks an imaginary front kick then she shifts her lead leg over for the rising block. She follows with another block and rising block. She then shifts on her lead foot, comes around in a horse stance. Now this is not a back stance, this is a horse stance. In a slash, she prepares, moves to her right, slashes again, and jumbi. Completes the pattern. Thank you for joining us. In our next video, we will be looking at the purple belt required pattern.